Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're gonna to be talking about flat back posture. What is flat back posture? Flat back posture is when your hips are underneath your rib cage. Shout out to Unigear for providing us this brace. We are gonna be doing a product review on this posture brace. Everyone's been asking about braces, about where to keep their shoulders. I think this is gonna be a big game changer. Check them out on Insta at Unigear Style. That's their handle. Check us out on Catalyst PTSA. That's our handle on the Insta. And check out the stories. So we're gonna put this thing through the ringer. Hey guys, I'm Dr. G, Catalyst Physical Therapy, San Antonio, Texas. Today we're gonna to be covering flat back posture. What is flat back posture? Flat back posture looks a little bit something like this. It's when your pelvis is in a posterior pelvic tilt. It's tucked in underneath you, okay? It's also called a flat butt posture, okay? And it's the opposite of a sway back or a lordotic posture, okay? So this has a lot of things that, it, that can create a lot of issues with your back, your hips, and your knees. I'm gonna show you how to fix that, how to correct it, and how to get you into a better position. Okay, so let's talk about the mechanical insufficiencies that flat back posture can create. So, especially nowadays when everyone's sitting down in front of a computer or at the desk for extended periods of time, what tends to happen is when you get up, and if you were to put yourself into this flat back posture, what it's gonna do, it's gonna take your hips completely out of the picture. Meaning, you're gonna have to use more of your lower back and more of your torso to try to hold yourself up against gravity, okay? Now, you can reverse that, okay? So, contrary to popular belief that you're stuck like this, you're not, okay? So, muscles can change the way the skeletal structure is carried. So, what you wanna do, this is gonna be very simple, okay? What you wanna do, is you wanna stand here, right? No weights needed. And what you wanna do is you wanna make a triangle, okay, with your hands, and you wanna bring your elbows up and bring those hands to your chin, okay? Now what that's doing, it's opening up your spine, okay? The body moves in synergistic movements. So when I do this, what happens, it makes my hips come out and it stretches my obliques. In the flat back posture, the muscles that are holding you in this position are your rectus abdominis, your internal and your external obliques. Now there's a way to stretch that and the best way to stretch it is with what is called the upright row. Okay, that's a view from the side. This is gonna be a view from the back. And this is gonna be a view from the other side. Okay. Do that, 10 repetitions, 10 second hold, you will feel a stretch. You'll feel a stretch through the abdomen to the bottom of the rib cage, and you will feel your hips activate. By doing that on a daily basis, especially if you have a flat back posture, if that's the way you're holding yourself up against gravity, this needs to be done every single day. And remember, muscle changes within six weeks. So every day, six weeks, 10 repetitions. Hold that position at the top for about 10 seconds. And I guarantee you'll start to see changes. If you have a lordotic posture, do not do this exercise, because then I'll see you in my waiting room because you can really hurt yourself, okay? This is strictly for people that have your flat back posture. Pelvis tucked underneath the rib cage. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching. I'm Dr. G, Catalyst Physical Therapy. Don't forget to click like and subscribe at the bottom. If you've missed any of our previous videos, click up here on the right-hand side. And keep an eye out on this product review. I'm pretty excited about that. If you have any products you want us to review, you can find our P.O. box down at the bottom. Anything, 
If you're an inventor, if you're creating something, you want me to check it out, give you an unbiased review, send it on over. Just check out the PO box at the bottom. See you next time.